In this sequence of projects for Scratch, we continue to reinforce and introduce a variety of coding practices and concepts largely centered around modularity, while continuing to introduce coders to a variety of tools and blocks, such as the pen blocks. Our sequence begins with a project where coders create a Nyan Cat simulator where a sprite draws rainbows while moving around the screen. We then further reinforce our understandings of pen blocks by creating a pumpkin carver project that allows a user to carve a pumpkin when they click their mouse. The following challenge asks coders to create art using a limited number of block types to encourage creativity within constraints while continuing to reinforce understandings of pen blocks. Our next project reinforces understandings of pen blocks and modularity by challenging coders to create algorithms that carve a pumpkin. We then create a music player app that demonstrates how to use a Boolean variable to create a toggle button, which is a button that switches between two states such as on or off. Our next project builds off of the previous maze game to create a new challenge, a player-controlled maze game where the player's sprite blinks. The following project is a sprite catcher game that reinforces the understandings of modularity while also encouraging young coders to customize their game using a variety of project extensions. The final three projects synthesize understandings from previous projects. The first synthesis project reinforces modularity by asking coders to create a talking function to animate a joke. What did the janitor say when she jumped out of the closet? The second synthesis project asks coders to create an interactive store display about a theme of their choice. This sequence concludes with a story or game about a superhero or superheroine. Each project includes a number of resources designed to assist a range of coders and facilitators from beginner through expert. Hey everyone, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not watching us on YouTube, you can find us on that platform as well as other social media outlets by searching for Boot Up PD. And if you're looking for more free lessons, projects, and resources for teachers and students, visit us at bootuppd.org where you can also learn about our high quality professional development.